Hello everyone, uh, it's a bit of a different video, uh, <laughs> hmm, it's not quite a review, it's, it's more, uh, first impressions, uh, really, I want to try these out and give my opinion on them. I needed to cut this out for an extra view anyway, so I, I figured, well, they arrived, why not? Uh, for now, I'm just going to be cutting out the, uh, Roy Roy, I think they're called? The, the little drone. And seeing how these compare with my old nippers. Well, they definitely cut through a lot cleaner. <laughs> I have to be a lot more careful with them too because once they go through they really just slice right through the plastic geez it's a massive step up for my old ones of course my old ones the uh the rivet holding them together in the center is stripped so i suppose that would probably explain it and yeah no these cut through way better geez so i am worried about them in the long run <laughs> They're definitely clacking a lot. Uh, I'm not putting very much pressure either. Uh, just... Goes right through the plastic. These are actually really nice. I was thinking about sharpening them, but honestly, I don't think that's necessary. Yeah, no, these cut really flat, too. It's quite nice. Maybe a little too flat, I can't get the part out. <laughs> Give me a second. There we go. Yeah, no, these actually work really well. Uh, I'm going to see how well they take the nubs off, too. I just noticed this one got broke, but... Not a big deal. Just see how cleanly it actually takes the nub off the part. Now, this is a rounded part, so... Oh, yeah, that's actually not that bad. A little bit left over, but uh... yeah, it comes off quite cleanly. I mean, I'm gonna have to clean it up with my hobby knife, but yeah, these work pretty good. Uh, you can get red and blue too. I I just like white. Uh, I got these for about ten bucks Canadian, so yeah, you know they're definitely lower end. You can see the, <laughs> the leftover nubs from the injection. But they work perfectly fine. In fact, they're definitely a step up from these ones, so I guess we'll see how long that lasts, considering these are a bit old at this point. And also they do have that busted rivet, so... Then again, I do remember these were not that nice, even new, so... Yeah, for 10 bucks, these are a pretty good deal, honestly. I mean, they're obviously not going to be god hands, but... They seem to cut through pretty well. I'll, uh, I'll put a comment if I remember. Actually, somebody remind me on Twitter in, like, a month. <laughs> Once I've broken these in, to put a comment on this video with an update, so you can check that. On I, I want to see the uh, longevity of these. Like if they if they work good now, but uh, if they go dull in a month, I mean, we'll see. Anyway, I need to 
finish building this. So I guess I'll see you guys in my next review. Thank you very much for watching. Feel free to share your own opinion on these down in the comments. I'd actually like to hear it. Give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, subscribe for future reviews. And you can watch my backlog. I have quite a sizable one at this point. And as always, until next time, happy building.